Hello elites and welcome back to Grand Theft Auto 5. This is the Thanksgiving Marathon and this is episode 29. I almost forgot what episode this was. Alright. <laughs> and I'm doing a marathon so it's like non-stop recording. Alright. So let's go. Do some missions. I want to go to the mission selected on my waypoint. And let me do something real quick. Let's turn up the sound effects and the music. Alrighty then. <sighs> I guess I can't turn up individual like voices. Oh well, we'll see how it looks in editing. Alrighty, well, <laughs> I guess I've got a long way to go. Okay then, we are here. And where is the little checkpoint thingy? I guess it's in his apartment. I have to freaking go to now. There it is. And Trevor is a, the Trevor. Trevor is a. Trevor is a what? Trevor uh, is a good guy. He cried family and got kicked and he froze. That, 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 that's it, right? Yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy. And, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's going to leave me. I mean, this is her place. And the fornicating? Is there Mr. Raspberry Jam? Whoa. Whoa. Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death. Bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some <laughs> girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Well, show me. Oh my god. Show me, boy. I, 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 I don't want to. <gasps> oh my god. Yeah, that's special, <laughs> but this boy gets the job done. All right? Now, Wade here says that you work at the docks. Uh, yes. Look at me. Can you just put your Johnson away, <laughs> sir? Oh, Jesus. Yes, I work at the docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man like me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, let's get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. We are going for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run. We got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it, team. I really miss Okay, then. Just cut him off, I guess. I guess we're going to Port City, then. Well, then, let's go. Oh, God. We have a long way to go. What the freak? Oh, crap. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. Uh, you're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're looking for something to steal. You hit me! Something to steal. Sir, I stole a pencil in elementary school and I've been regretting it ever since. Lord always was a stick in the mud. Uh, look. <laughs> Oh, great. Ah. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect turd. I can't quite describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. <laughs> I'm aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? $236 billion worth of cargo in through the... Okay then. Port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put price tags on them. Have you noticed anything? Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Merryweather folks hanging around. 
Meriwether Security Consulting. Private army to the New World Order. My butt's gone The folks now. waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil? That, um, sounds like them. So there's a private militia in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter. Perfect. Can I get on board? No, no. Uh, they won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. Go park and get this hatch. Yep, will do. <laughs> Go park and get the dispatch. <laughs> Over here's dispatch. Here comes the. Oh. Spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Hope you got a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Ew. Great. That sucks for him. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. You ever got helicopters coming in and out of here? You know those big sky crane things that could pick up a whole container? Now this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. Shoot it, Dad. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that stretched to 50 feet. Now what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner over. <laughs> I just said they had the water surface real. We need to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. Good. I don't know what we're doing. You! You! We need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby gotta be brought up to F. That ain't a question! Okay, there we go. I think my dog's gonna be an escape artist. So I'm in the basement right now, and they put her in the laundry room to sleep in because it is cold outside. Because you know she can't sleep in the patio when it's cold. It's freaking winter now. And um, just around you, and it's just cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together. Stick to the story. He'll be fine. Boy's on a waste clearance crew. He's never happier when he's neck deep in shit. They're gonna check on. Well, basically. It's still fall, but it's cold now in Colorado. And so now she has a warmer place to sleep, which is... Oh, fuck, I missed a spot. It's those two blue ones, huh? Fuck, okay. But yeah, I can hear her scratching at the um, little doggy gate. It's those containers, baby. She is really trying to get out. All I can hear is, like, clawing. I'm trying to, I'm trying to concentrate on the game and not concentrate on her. Cheeky, stop it! She out. is destined to get out. She's like, oh, I want to okay, get out. We got. It. Let's take her down to bed. I know. Okay then. Handlers, because they handle like a dream. <laughs> this ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank fuck a high a kite. <laughs> you should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate <gasps> you under the. You little rat! Oh my God, she got out. Hey, come here, you ugly little rat. Okay, you know what? I'll deal with you once I'm done. Oh my god, she got out. I'm I can't even drive. Where are you, chickies? Come here. She likes that sound. You gotta make kissing noises. You'll be like, and then she'll come over. She's not like other dogs. We gotta be like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Get how to do this, okay? Alright, well I'm just gonna drop off this one for now, and next episode we will pick up another the other one. And it will continue. 
send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, anyways. The cranes, but... cranes. Uh, leave a like and enjoy this episode. Subscribe today to be kindly and not miss out on any new content uploads. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I'll see you in the next video that I create. I'll see you in the... Uh, uh, I gotta deal with this dog. And so, goodbye, elites. Goodbye.